The statistics are staggering. Every year, nearly two million people die of tuberculosis. These deaths are senseless because tuberculosis is curable. I'm a survivor. I, I spent 20 months in hospital as a teenager. When I had TB, I was determined that I wanted to find a cure for this awful scourge. Um, and, and, well, when I grew up, I, I wanted to be part of the campaign to, to say we can make our world TB free. Desmond Tutu inspires people everywhere to ask the question, are we doing enough to stop TB? And the clear answer is, we are not. We need to reach the people who are not getting the treatment they need now. And we must invest much more in research to better prevent, diagnose and cure TB. We have made strides, you know, but I think when you have a disease that is killing 1.7 million to 2 million people every year, um, speed is of the utmost importance, you know. We face enormous challenges. Drug-resistant tuberculosis is not being addressed with sufficient speed or commitment. And the deadly combination of tuberculosis and HIV AIDS continues to devastate communities across the world. TB is still not getting the emergency response that it needs, neither in care efforts in countries nor in the research arena. But together, individuals and organizations working in partnership are making progress against tuberculosis. So what we need is money, adequately priced medicine, and adequately priced diagnostics. And then we need the systematic organization necessary to execute this. But as usual, I find that people who are living with this problem are ahead of most of us who are trying to deal with it. And we need to, to, we know what works. I think we just need to fund it and then make sure that there's a systematic capacity to execute it. The community program in Kibaha, Tanzania, shows how, even with limited resources, people can use what they have and work together successfully to fight TB. With support from doctors from a nearby hospital, former tuberculosis patients educate their neighbors about the disease and support those who are sick as they complete their treatment, making frequent home visits. TB is 100% curable and we can stop TB, but all members of society must be involved in the fight. I'm working for TB, but what are you doing to stop TB? That's the most important question, and we should ask that question to everyone. Only through leadership, collaboration, and innovation can we make our world TB free and save millions of lives each year. Partnership, partnership, partnership at community level, at every level of society, is absolutely key. If there is to be real progress on HIV TB, it will only be through strategic and strategic and coordinated collaboration across communities all over the world. Well, I mean, I would want to see a world that is free of TB. And the way to get there is for us all to roll up our sleeves and to put our shoulders to the wheel, to do the things that we know we can do. We don't, we don't have to reinvent wheels. The drugs are there, the methodology is there. For goodness sake, let's get cracking. We call on everyone to join the call to stop TB. We can stop tuberculosis. We simply must. <laughs>